out in the centre. The defending champ is up. Melissa Miles is in trouble. Melissa Miles is left standing from Cronulla. So we started off with three from the Cronulla club in the final eight. But in the final two, it'll be Molly Mook versus Swansea Belmont. Lisa Wright. Howard in the black and white cap. And up they come. Howard's got a big start again. Bit of a stumble there from Lisa Wright. It's a dive. Howard got lower. Got the flag underneath Lisa Wright. They hug. They kiss. But try and get the beach flag off Melissa Howard. I, re I reckon you need some wild dogs to get it off her. She just snuck under a guard there. There was nothing bad in that. She just used her body weight, got underneath and got the flag. Fantastic. Oh, exhausting stuff. And isn't she pumped up, Melissa Howard? As I mentioned, won the under-19 title 2005. Won the Open title last year. And with the full weight of Lisa right on her back, she managed to snaffle that beach flag. Watch this. Right just hops on her back. Longer arms, taller, bit heavier, but the little pocket rocket gets... Stumble. Now we're down to three, and now Melissa Howard is closest to you. She's so strong off that push and turn. Howard closest to you, then Hickman and Steele, who competed in the Winter Olympics in the skeleton event not too long ago, back in 2006. Howard getting ready for a start. Off they go. A little bit of pushing, it seems, between Howard and Hickman. Steele has been oh, caught oh, out oh, the back. And just a bit of what oh, for there, Richie? Bargy, bargy there. She sort of, Howard nudged her teammate over and saying, listen, there's a flag over there. Don't take mine. Chanel Hickman closest to us, the favourite. Melissa Howard on the outside. She's going for a seventh title in this event. There's a massive crowd around to watch this one. It's a favourite for all on the beach. We'll wait for the call. Down they go. Looks like a tight start. Howard looks like she's moved in front at this stage. Howard dives. Seven in a row. And she's pumped. And why wouldn't she be Leachy? How good is that? Oh, she is over the moon. I've watched her win so many of these titles. She is nearly unbeatable, this girl. And uh, what control. Like, look at that. She is just over the moon. Tears are coming out. And... She's very proud. You should be very proud with that. On that the is replay, a fantastic effort. And it's Howard on the left-hand side. She gets in front with just an elbow and an arm. Well, Not much in it nothing. in terms of raw Look speed. What a sensational performance. You can see how she uses her body strength to just sneak in front and say, that's why I'm the king of the beach, queen of the beach. She is everything, this lady. Have well, a look at that. They're great shots. She. Great shots, aren't they? And she just got her fingertips on it, didn't she? Just before the... Uh, the you know, so the, dominant. Oh. Back to the girls now. Katie Williams there, Collaroy, Mel Howard in the middle, Chanel Hickman on the top end from Corumban as we view Chanel as we're just about to take off. They're off, they're going. Oh, look at Howard, blast them off. She looks over the shoulder. Oh, wow, drops the shoulder. Chanel Hickman, the girl from Corumban, she picked it. She's come over and she has literally bumped Katie Williams out of the race. Wow, what a finish. It's the old club mates, Hickman and Howard. Howard's up, Hickman's next. Oh, Hickman dropping the shoulder on Howard. She can't do it. Wow, she even tried to hold her back, but to no avail. Melissa Howard from Karawa. She has done it yet again. Another title. That's nine. Unbelievable. Melissa Howard, there it is. Nine titles. Unbelievable. Embraces there some of the club mates. Look at the emotion. That meant everything. And boyfriend Paul Crockroft Wilson there from Cara also. So it's another goal to Melissa Howard. She's done it yet again. Well, Mel Howard, the queen of the flags. How does it feel to win title number nine? I'm ecstatic. I uh, just can't believe it. I was a bit worried coming in from the, the heat. So I was feeling a bit sluggish, but um, got up there in the end. You got a great run through that top eight, but talk us through that final run there with uh, Chanel, a great battle. Yeah, we, we both turn the same way, so we both prefer a certain side, but, you know, in the end, you've got to win from either, and today I've done it. Number nine's in the bag. Is number 10 well and truly in the sights now? Oh, number 10's on the card, so, you know, it'd be great if I could get it next year, but if I don't get it next year, I'm going to keep going until I get it. Well done, Mel. Congratulations on the title. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.